It got worse. It got so much worse. So if you don't know, Pet Simulator 99 gave hackers and exploiters the rarest pets which no one is happy with. And I made a video on it literally last night. But now things have gotten so much worse. So do you remember this tweet? Yeah, let's reward exploiters and hackers by giving them the most expensive pets in the game. Don't reward players who support the community support hackers good job big games. Well, she had a partner in Pet Sim 99, but now that's been taken away due to her speaking out. Here is proof. This is just horrible. So basically, if you speak bad about big games, pet sim, or day anything about the drama, you'll get banned or removed from pet sim 99. And now, it gets worse. You know how I said that pet sim's YouTube owner said the worst thing possible to reply to this. Well, now, he's replied to other comments and he may have done it worse. You honestly should be fired for some of the worst PR ever. And he said I think I deserve a promotion. Well, yeah, I don't like the negativity. But all this started after Cotter Joey. And he replied it started because people love drama. This just shows that Preston and big games really don't care. And they are willing to ban literally anyone no matter who it is. They even ban someone's dad. Big Games is done. Big Games is going downhill and Big Games is dying.